All right, so the next pigment we're going to talk about is the flavonoid group. We have two groups. The first group is going to be anthocyanins. Um, something interesting, if you break down this word in Greek, antho means flower, cyan means blue, so blue flowers. So this group is red, blue, and purple. It actually is the pigment that gives red, blue, and purple flowers their color. So kind of a way to remember what is a anthocyanin. Cyan blue, not to be confused with anthoxanthins, which is going to be your whites, um, like cauliflower. So, um, back to anthocyanins is, um, again, our red, purple, blues. So beets, red cabbage, um, they are soluble in water and have large changes in pH. Um, so if you put it in an alkaline or basic solution, um, it's going to be turning more blue. If you put something like red cabbage in an acidic solution, it's going to get more bright red um, or kind of like a magenta color is what it actually turns into. Um, our anthoxanthins. So our xanthins, again, cauliflower was the example um, in one of the videos that I posted. Uh, they're a little bit lengthy, but it helps you remember then it's worth it. Um, so cauliflower, obviously this is um, our group that are white and they are water soluble. Um, when you put it in an acidic solution, the cauliflower kind of just stays white, maybe gets a little brighter white, um, but it's kind of described as a colorless in acidic solution. And then your alkaline or your basic solution um, becomes more yellow. So how I was kind of remembering this, when you look at how it's spelled, it's anthoxanthins. The last part of the word is thins, so thin. I think of, you know, somebody who is extremely sick, they're really thin, they might be pale or colorless or white. Um, it's kind of how I remembered the uh, anthoxanthins. Um, and then something else to note with this group, um, so, for example, another white um, pigmented vegetable is onion, right? Um, you have some different colors, but for the most part, we're talking about a white onion. Uh, if you put it in an aluminum pan, it will turn yellow, like our alkaline or our basic mediums. So do remember that. That can turn yellow in an aluminum pan, um, or even if you're doing using some different utensils or stuff, um, it might turn your vegetables yellow. So... Um, that is our flavonoids, anthocyanins, red, blue, purple, like our blue flowers, and anthoxanthins are going to be our white vegetables and produce.